guys welcome back okay so today i wanted to do a quick little swatch party i got some new singles in the mail this week that i ordered a few weeks back from m cosmetics and i'm really excited to swatch these because i saw them first on indie makeup spotlight which is amy or amy loves makeups Instagram page and I was like those are pretty I want to try some of them so I picked up some of the single shadows from M Cosmetics and way back in December I guess when I was doing my holiday shopping I also ordered some singles from Touch of Glam so the ones that I have on the top the, the round ones are all from M Cosmetics and these beautiful shimmers on the bottom are from Touch of Glam. Now, the Touch of Glam, I'll just say right off the bat, they are pretty pricey. I did get to, you know, get a discount during the holiday season when I ordered mine. And it did take quite a while for me to receive them. And I mean, a few months. So, just FYI, for M Cosmetics, it took a few weeks, I think, for those to come. But yeah, let me just give you a closer look at the singles I'm going to swatch today. So these up here are M Cosmetics. These are Touch of Glam. And I did, I just kind of picked out some colors that I thought were pretty and, you know, I wanted to try out. So I'm going to go ahead and start with the M Cosmetics shadows. Let me just see if I can give you a little bit of information about M Cos. M Cosmetics. So it looks like their shadows are about $5.72, just the few that I'm skimming through right now each. Now what it says here is M Cosmetics is a small business based in Kitchener, Canada. We manufacture and sell our own makeup and cosmetic line. Our products are all handmade and cruelty free, formulated with few ingredients, which makes them a healthier option. So that's just a little bit that's in there about a section. And you guys know I love trying out indie brands, supporting indie brands, and buying makeup from indie brands. So, you know, if they're not controversial. So let's go ahead and swatch some of these. Hopefully I can read these names on these stickers on the back. So let me just give you a close-up look. This is what the shadows look like. If you can see that, it has like a little imprint of, I think, an E and a C for M Cosmetics. And then on the back, it does have here their logo along with the shadow name. So this first one here is My Angel. Looks like a really pretty, ooh, okay. So it's a really light pink but you can't see it that much you know here but there is just a slight slight bit of iridescence to it I mean it's very very unique because it's not what I would consider a shimmer but it's not a matte either <laughs> so yeah it's really pretty though very very gorgeous I don't know if you can see that slight amount of iridescence in there Okay, this next shadow is Wildflower, and that's what that looks like, Wildflower. They're very pigmented. I actually picked up a little bit more of that one than I wanted, but I was able to just blend that out nicely. That color is gorgeous. Oh, that's pretty. Next, we have Tanzanite. This color is so, so pretty. Tanzanite. This shadow is Neptune. That's very, very pretty. Oh my gosh. That shadow is gorgeous. This color is Universe. Universe, as in Y O U, Universe. <laughs> it's so crazy because to me, it looks purple. But in the camera, it looks like that chocolate green shade. But to me, it looks purple. Oh, that's crazy. Very crazy. Oh my gosh. 
You guys see that? I know you can see that shift. Ooh, that's pretty. It's like that turquoise kind of, I don't know, very hard to describe, but I know you see that shift. That's gorgeous. Okay, you guys, next we have the shade Olympo. Very, very pretty shimmery shade. Oh my gosh, that was so freaking smooth. So smooth. Oh, that's pretty. This is Athena. Athena. This one looks kind of similar to Olympo, but it's just like, I don't know if it's a little darker. Yeah, it's a little darker. Oh my gosh. That's why I had to get both of them because, oh, so, so pretty. Look at that sheen, you guys. That is so gorgeous. Next, we have Serendipity. So that one is more just kind of like a satin, it looks like. But as you can see, there is a shift in there. I don't know if you can see that. Very, very pretty. It's not really exactly my, you know, style or whatever, but it is a gorgeous shadow though. Very pretty. Okay, so now I wanna swatch the matte shades. This first one here is Palm Tree. And I think I'm gonna swatch them right here. Ooh, hello. <laughs> hello, Palm Tree and pigmentation. Okay, nice. Oh, that's pretty. What do y'all think? That look good on me? That's gorgeous. Next is Terracotta. Terracotta. Whoa. And these shadows are a little bit powdery, but I know that's because they are very pigmented. As you can see, they're not sheer at all. And oh my goodness, very opaque. I cannot wait to play with these. <laughs> Next is Elysian. Elysian. Gorgeous, kind of like light lilac lavendery shade. So pretty. Next, we have Marine. It's like I'm almost excited that they're kind of powdery because, yo, it's like the pigmentation. Ugh. And these colors are really unique to my collection. I do not have. Um, these colors in my collection. Look at that blue, you guys. Oh my goodness. And I did pick up a couple of transition shades. So this one is, is it Carrot Smoothie? <laughs> Carrot Smoothie. So that is Carrot Smoothie on my skin tone. And last, I got Cocoa Truffle. That looks like it's going to be a really, really nice transition shade. I know these are some crazy swatches, <laughs> but that is Cocoa Truffle on my skin tone. Yeah, that is like the perfect transition shade for me. Very pretty. So those are the mattes very nicely pigmented oh my goodness and those are the shimmers so those are all of the m cosmetics shadows that i have so far and i'm telling you i cannot wait to try them out okay you guys so i really wish i could tell you the names of these shadows while i'm swatching them but the writing on these shadows are so freaking small for a touch of glam Oh my goodness, look how small that is. Now, on the camera, you can probably read it, you can probably see it, but it's so small, honey, I cannot see that. So, I'm just gonna swatch them. After the fact, when I'm editing, I will put the name on the screen, okay? <laughs> so that's how we gonna do this. Now, with Touch of Glam Beauty, like I did state earlier, they are a bit pricey, but their shimmers and duochromes are 
extremely gorgeous and unique. So it just kind of depends on what you're looking for in your collection. And you guys know, I'm always looking for something pretty and unique. <laughs> so let's go ahead and swatch this one. So that's the first one. This is the next one. This is the next one. Gorgeous, gorgeous blue shade. And you have to be careful not to pick too much of the shadow up. It's very tempting to just kind of dig in there and swirl your finger, but there's really no need because these are extremely pigmented. Very pretty. This one is gorgeous. You see that shimmer in there? Oh, that's pretty. Very, very pretty. Kind of like light baby doll type pink. This is really pretty. It's kind of like a mint green. Ooh, look at that one. That one is really, really pretty. Let's see if it swatches just as nice. Yeah, that's pretty. This is the next shadow, kind of like a really pretty silvery gray. Whew. Yeah, that is one of my favorites. I don't know why I love kind of like metal or gunmetal gray shimmer so much, but I do. And I never wear them. <laughs> I never wear them, but look at that. Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's gorgeous. Y'all need to be in the comments like, KK, you know you need to do a gray eye look. <laughs> okay. Oh, very, very pretty. This is kind of like a shimmery gold type duochrome. Gorgeous. Another beautiful kind of silver type shade. This is like a beautiful kind of like lemon drop yellow. Oh, that's pretty. Perfect for spring. Oh my goodness. Can you guys see that green shift in there or is it just me? Yo, that is a, now that is a shift for real. Do you guys see that green shift in there? I hope you can. Oh my gosh, look at that. It's like a lemon drop yellow with green in there. Oh, that's pretty. And lastly, I have this gorgeous shade here. Don't even know how to really describe it. <laughs> so that is that shape there. It kind of looks a little bit like a lavender type shadow. Oh, that's gorgeous. Yeah, so it's like with these, there are some that really, really stand out to me and that are just super gorgeous. The pink, an absolute favorite. The one, this one here, this gold, kind of brassy gold, gorgeous. This dark gray, kind of like, you know, metallic gray. And this shifting green and yellow, like what? <laughs> like what? So yeah, I definitely have some favorites out of these Touch of Glam shadows. And I'm just gonna have to like blow out a mat in my crease 
and just put this on my lid because these shadows really kind of speak for themselves when you wear them. So that's it, you guys. I just wanted to do a quick little swatch party and, you know, just show you the shadows that I have got and have added to my singles collection in case you're curious about these and you kind of wanted to see live swatching. Here you go, girl. Here you go. <laughs> okay, so... Thanks so much for watching and hanging out with me today and I will see you on my next video.